Hi, I'm Linda from Barlati's Body Blitz and this is my fur baby Minnie eating some snacks. Hopefully she'll stay in the shop the whole time. Today we're doing a workout called Mobility Sculpt. So it's not a traditional Barlati's burn challenging workout as such, although you will still feel the burn. It is more about mobilizing the joints and really helping to create balance in the body. So we'll be using a Pilates band and last one. Now I want you to start coming down side to side. So you should feel a really nice stretch through your lower body as well. And we're back. Circle around and back. Stand down. Feeling your waistline engaging here, your obliques, and warming up through the waist. Eight, eight more like this. A few more like this. Eight, three, Continue that rotation, then pressing forward and diagonal. And because you're doing both at the same time, really draw your belly button in here and you are pressure into your hands with straight legs. All the way back and launch. Okay, so it's in, out, squeeze. Foot down, squeeze to the side. Deep breaths. Squeeze those glutes, that's what this is for. In and to the corner, in and to the corner. You're coming directly in line with your chest and then all the way overhead, your shoulders, the other arm fully anchored. The other arm is fully on the mat. Just a few more and then we're going to pick up one arm at a time again. Two, I don't want to see any noodles. One. And same thing here, but your arm is bent and we're going to go more to the side. A few more like this, a bit back in line. You can put your hands underneath your butt and back in. It's rotate out and back in, but I want you to initiate the move from the hips. One, now I want you to start figurating the arms. So lift off the mat and start reaching down towards the mat, through your shoulders and upper back, and even in the chest there. Just two more like this, the head, but you're still gonna stay in that seated position and three, behind, straighten, over the top. This is, and your armpits to the front, three, and out, in, and out. It's really tough to get this rise. Four, three, down, and little arch at the top. Now I'm using my hand to kind of support me a little bit, but try not to do it too much. Four, up and down. Once again, don't come out of this bend. Extend and bring it in. Extend all the way, sweep it, squeeze that glute and really keep the legs super straight. So once again, think about bend it and come up. So it's easier here to think about the knee. It burns and we like that little extra burn on the end. Three, two, last one. Eight, two, what you need to do, but make sure it's challenging. It's not going to come up super high either, and that's fine. One, now box out your arm, and you're going to be pushing off this. You may want to angle this in, and we're going to pick up that leg, squeeze, tap. Squeeze and tap. Today we're doing mobility lower body. So it's mostly lower body, you will still feel some core engagement and a little bit of upper body for support, but we are going to be focusing on opening up through all of our lower body joints, our hips, our knees, even our ankles. So you will need a mat and you will also need a chair to hold on to, make sure it's nice and sturdy. It's not all the way back, we're going to get to that. Opposite leg and it's front and side, just opening up through those hips, in. So you're tapping your toe down, and again, you don't have to lift super high here. Okay. 
This one is a little bit tougher, so rotate on your toe, pick it up and back in. In, rounding the spine and then swinging back. Little bend in the back leg, big circles around. And you do a few straight leg, just a few, all the way up and around. And then we're going to come the other way with a bent leg. And can you make it straight? Around and in. And then slightly internal rotation. Raise the leg up. So you're raising your leg on a diagonal to the back of these. So bend in and sweep it up. Bend in, up towards the corner. Down and down. So it's up, it's rotate. Rotate back down and down. So try and get out quite wide. Close it up. Rotate out for two, open it up. So it's in for two, then bring it together, cross, step, shoot. Now, you can put your hand down if you like, all the way down if you can, if not, maybe just here. I want open, cross, open, cross with your legs up. Figure eight rotations with your hips, so side, to side. You're pushing your hip to the side and to the other side. Higher. You can even use the seat of the chair. I'm going to try and find a flow holding at each point for a second. And it's a balance challenge to get that leg up. Four more. Getting the heart rate up a little bit. Three. And back extend. Bend and extend. And my heel is coming in and up. Out and one, rotate the other way, out and around. Grab your ankle or your heel, then maybe just grab your shin. Breathe, we're gonna keep the legs straight. Cross and back up quick, cross back up, catch. Otherwise, bend, extend, bend, extend. And you're gonna come across and across. Turn your hip, straight and hip, straight and hip. Rotate through your hips. Today we're doing mobility combinations. So we're going to be focusing on opening up through the body, really feel good moves, as well as a bit of burn as always, and some combination building. So starting off with a kind of easier move and layering on so that your brain gets a good workout as well and we're using all those muscles in different angles. Back and in. Both legs are remaining bent. Line and step in. Step back, reach all the way overhead and then back in, slightly to the back, and wrapping your inner thighs forward. And stay low, but remaining in that plie position. Last one, up, up. Now stay here, and start raising the leg as you extend. Maybe bend the supporting leg. It's back, it's down, up. Down, up, it's cross behind and out and to the front and to the back. It's up and down. Now I understand, raise up and down with the back leg. Up and down, so this is a lot easier. Up, down, up, down. Look in front of you. It's extend, push across and then in. Extend across. Shoot your leg up, turn your hip out, across and in. So your back leg is getting a lot of work. Wrapping in, so it's like you're pushing, you have sliders and you're pulling your feet together. Okay, so you're pulling in. Now you're up, you're pulling in with those feet, but I want you to think about the lower glute wrapping in. Up, in with the feet, wrap under with the glutes. Now I want you to do tiny pulses up from this contracted position. We're gonna go in, 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 in. We're not going to contract the glutes too much. Just stay up fully, tummies are in, and pull in, in. We imagine you are squeezing something in between your butt cheeks, but I'm talking about your lower butt cheeks, the lowest point of your butt cheek. Cross it, out, out, cross it. We do this faster and dynamic. It's down, it's up, it's down, it's up. Down and up and down and up. 